Hi friends, in today's video, we are going to be adding a printer to this MacBook Air, super simple process. Let's do this right now. So this video tutorial is actually going to be useful for anybody using a Mac. I am actually upgraded to the latest version of the Mac OS, which is Catalina. And I'm going to be using this Epson printer. You can see here's the model number. This is actually a Wi-Fi printer, so there's actually some easier ways to do this via Wi-Fi. I'm gonna show you the absolutely easiest way, and that is to use the USB cable that's connected from the printer. You can see the gray cable going in over there. And now taking this end and just plugging it straight into our Mac. And what I'm gonna do is without any other software, I'm just gonna stick this directly in here, making sure the printer is on. So let's go ahead and hit that on button real quick. And then we're gonna come over here and we're actually gonna put the USB directly into the slot. On my MacBook Air, and I've actually opened up the system preferences up here. And you can find this either in your apps folder or down in your dock. It's that little gear icon. And once you open that up, you're gonna have a few options, including this printers and scanners. I'm actually gonna click on this. Now watch what happens when I plug in that Epson printer. It's gonna stick that into my USB port and immediately the Mac is gonna to go to work finding that specific model. You can see it just automatically grabbed it and loaded up the drivers. And now you can see that it's gonna be available here. Most of the modern printers will have a database with Mac that it can locate the specific drivers and set it up automatically for you. So it's again, it's a really, really neat option. One of the things you can do now that we have this uh, up in here is actually go down here and set this up as our default printer. Again, this is our only one, so it's nice and easy. And that way when you're printing, your Mac is automatically gonna know to look for this specific printer to print from. I hope that's helped, friends. If it has, would you guys hit that thumbs up button for me down in the description box? And if you could subscribe, we got a bunch more Mac tutorial tricks, tips, tutorial videos that are coming up real soon. Thanks so much for watching.